Well, the Halloween festivities already underway as State Street merchants are hosting their annual trick or treat. Let's check back in with News 3 Susan Simon now live at the Madison Children's Museum on the Capitol Square. Susan. Thank you, Maria. It looks like Freak Fest has already started. These are folks waiting to get into the museum. And if you've lived in Madison for any period of time, you'll recall that before Freak Fest became a city sanctioned event, the celebration had a lot of problems. There were often unruly crowds and vandalism. But as you mentioned, Frank Productions and the city stepped in. They turned it into a gated event that you need a ticket to attend, and the problems really decreased. And today, Mayor Dave said he's hoping to build on that success for the sixth straight year. Well, I hope so. You know, I, I think so. Of course, you know, we'll be vigilant. We'll uh, have enough police officers there uh, just in case. But, you know, it's been five years now and things have gone so smoothly. So uh, I'm feeling pretty good that we've turned the corner. A lot of the things that we needed early on, we don't need anymore. And it's really become a fun uh, music festival with costumes. And so, uh, you know, we're just hoping people come down, have fun, and, and be safe, and it'll be a great night. Let's hope so. The gates open at 7 o'clock tomorrow night, and the tickets are $10. Maria? Looks like a lot of fun. Thanks so much, Susan, for that report.